Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Nikki Marie, back with another vlog. So it is November 1st, so we are starting a new vlog for this month. And right now I just got ready cause I'm gonna go to the mall for maybe a birthday outfit or just some pieces that I need. I need leggings and I'm gonna just see what else I see. So yeah, let's go to the mall. Okay, so I'm a mess. So the last time you guys saw me, I did not find any outfits at the mall. And now it is, my birthday hun and i look crazy so i got so drunk last night that i am so hungover and i booked my hair appointment for 9 a.m and now i'm like bruh how the fuck am i gonna go to this hair appointment like this <sighs> i have to go all right, you guys, so back from the hair salon, this is how it looks. I did have her cut a lot off because my ends were looking crazy. So super short, well, not that short, but you know, short enough. So she did cut a little bit of layers here. Not too much, not like the Jordan Witch picture, but you know, it's cute. But like I said, I'm freaking, exhausted so i'm going to bed it is 11 something right now so i was in there for like two hours the service at this salon is so freaking good like it's just disgusting how good it is my last stylist was just she was just all over the place like she would be late all the time like just unprofessional so yeah i'm going to bed it is my birthday and i'm gonna go to sleep <laughs> so i gotta get prepared for later yeah i'll see you guys later i guess and i didn't go get the freaking nails that i was supposed to go get i have all nails but except this one and i don't have any extras because i had already used those nails before so I didn't have any extra, so I'm gonna have to take these off. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hey guys, today is Monday, November 8th. Today, I was waiting for my dishwasher, new dishwasher to come because the other one broke. I contacted my landlord and she, she just ordered a new one. So they came and he was like, basically the valves underneath the sink to turn the water off were old and he didn't trust like turn it off because he thought they were gonna break and then there'd be water everywhere so he didn't install the dishwasher so i just have a dishwasher sitting in my dining room office space so basically oh y'all like my hair i did get it straightened for my birthday it's already a little fluffy especially on this side i was in bed all day recovering yesterday from just an episode of me being drunk but yeah but yeah so basically thursday of this week i'm getting my apartment painted they're starting the painting on thursday so basically i guess that guy knows how to do other stuff so he's gonna look at the dishwasher and see if he can install it i guess so shout out to my landlord she's always been a great landlord and she's always on point i've never had my apartment painted it needs to be painted so yeah, we're going with the gray which i'm excited about i'm surprised she even was like letting me do not letting me because i was gonna let her pick white if she wanted white but the color that i have now is like a cream color and it's pretty ugly but i've dealt with it for almost 10 years that i've lived here so but yeah i'm excited for the gray i might want to buy some new furniture because i'm just kind of over my little sectional i like sectionals but like don't mind the ring light i had to move that out the way because they had to bring the dishwasher in but i like sectionals but this one is just it gives me like bachelor pad vibes and i got this with my ex and you know we just decided on this and you know it is what it is but so i just kind of want like something different like maybe like a white cream color since i'm gonna have gray walls because i was thinking about getting a gray sectional at first but now i'm gonna have gray walls so i don't know i might get a white sofa who knows but but anyways today on the agenda i have to move everything off the walls and I have to move everything kind of to the center of each room so it can be ready for Thursday. 
and I can't do it by myself so my friends come in over to help me yeah it'll just be in the middle of the floor until they get started on painting so it's gonna be a little annoying but I'm excited for the paint I wanted to give you guys an update on my diet so basically I decided to not be on keto anymore <laughs> I know it's kind of dropping a bomb on you guys but i decided that i just want to have a regular diet i'm still tracking everything i eat um, i'm still eating the same amount of calories yeah so we'll see how this goes of me just eating regular foods i'm still not eating like sweets and stuff like that but i am gonna be incorporating bread and rice into my diet so but right now i'm about to watch the horrible decisions podcast i usually like to leave my podcast for work because i listen to them while i'm working and that's just entertaining for me especially when i'm out on my route i need a podcast or something oh if you guys have any other podcasts that you guys listen to that you find entertaining um let me know down below in the comments so ones i listen to is horrible decisions love that cocktails with kiki and medina love that too i do listen to some real estate podcasts like old dogs talking about real estate investing in real estate oh poor minds with drea and lex p love that i listened to sophia with an f and i couldn't get through an episode she was on horrible decisions i found her pretty entertaining when she was on horrible decisions but her own podcast it just wasn't giving it just was not giving at all so i definitely am going to be unsubscribing to her i also listened to lip service bully and the beast rich dad i listen to him sometimes and um tony robbins podcast sometimes but like i said leave your podcast suggestions down below i've tried to listen to joe button sometimes i'll listen to the breakfast club interviews of people that i'm interested in hearing what they gotta say but yeah i need some more podcasts to add to my list cause I'm... but today i want some chipotle for lunch i was watching um b simone and desi and they were doing a mukbang and they were eating chipotle and i haven't had chipotle or even just rice and stuff like that in general and so yeah i'm excited to have some of that today i'll see you guys in a little bit hun. all right you guys so it's a while later and made some progress got almost everything off the walls i still got a couple things that mirror there and then this mirror yeah look look at this look everything is away from walls and when i tell you this couch has not been moved in the five or so years that i've had it here there is so much dust and dirt back here it is disgusting there's a spot there that i don't even know what that is it's black brown i don't know but i need to vacuum this also look at this window sill i haven't seen this window sill in five years and it's dusty as hell so i need to vacuum this up <laughs> this looks so crazy it looks like i'm moving or something so hopefully this is good enough because we ain't got nowhere else to put this. Um, it's going to have to stay here, but it's enough space for the painters to come in and do what they got to do. There's still a couple of things on the wall that I can't get out. I can't find my hammer, so I can't get out most of the nails. But hopefully the painters, you know, have a hammer and can take that out because I am. So here's the office. I've put my... um nightstands out here and here's my room my bed was all made this morning and now it's a freaking mess but it's in the middle of the room it's away from the wall and then i gotta move that treadmill and this away from the wall still but i have until thursday it's only monday i wanted to move the bigger pieces with my friends so that i didn't have to do that by myself because i don't think that would happen but i think i'm gonna get rid of my big tapestry that i had on the wall i might just keep it just in case I want to put it back up. But I think that I want to try something different. Maybe get something different for that wall. And then I think I want to get rid of that like stand that I have in there. I wanted to get a dresser before. But I'm not so sure I want to get a dresser. I kind of want to just get something. Maybe decorative piece or something like that. But right now it's actually kind of comfortable sitting right here. And being way closer to the TV. <laughs> so... 
I'm just sitting right here in the mix of all this and gonna relax for a bit because I mean because it's my day off so why wouldn't I relax but um yeah that's pretty much all that's going on see you guys later good morning guys so today is veterans day happy veterans day to all the veterans out there Matter of fact, my aunt is a veteran of the Air Force and I'm going to go over to my grandma's today. I don't know what we're going to do, but I'll be over there after I get off work. So update on the painting hasn't happened yet, as you guys can see. Um, I'm trying to show you a little bit, but I can't really show you, but you can see the walls are still the same. They're not gray yet. So my landlord had asked me which day I wanted and I told her Thursday. She said Wednesday or Thursday and I told her Thursday, but then she texted me yesterday today saying that they would come Thursday to drop the paint off and then they're gonna start Friday so besides that I am eating breakfast making coffee I'm eating oatmeal with strawberries and pineapple I haven't had coffee in a few days I took a few days off because I was literally getting addicted addicted to the coffee and um I still am probably just caffeine in general but yeah I need to get myself together I do have to work today so we are just delivering packages today so hopefully it's a light day today but yeah I just wanted to talk to y'all real quick about that so yeah I'll see you guys later bye good morning guys so update on the room if you guys can see my room is painted let me try to show you guys, hold on. Dang, I don't know if you can even tell. So my room is gray. I don't even know if you can tell, but I guess you can tell because the baseboard is white and the walls are gray. So, so far he has only gotten done my room. It looks pretty good. Uh, I switched my room around. I had my bed on this side and I decided to move it over here just so when you walk in the room like you see the bed, you see the decor that I have. So I've been trying to do a lot of organizing in here. I've put like little cubes in there to organize like my hair stuff. Before I kept my hair stuff on that big metal thing that I had in here. It was like, anyways, it was like a metal thing that I had, a metal shelf in here that I had. And I got rid of that because I just don't want it anymore. So I am going to take it to my grandma's house probably today and give that to her for her basement or whatever. I'm thinking about getting, getting a TV in here. But the thing is, I don't have cable. I haven't had cable since, since I've been single. And that's been like three years I haven't had cable. I just watch YouTube literally all the time. So I haven't had cable, but I'm thinking about getting YouTube TV because I feel like it has enough channels for that i would want to watch because i really only watch like bravo and like vh1 and stuff like that so i'm thinking about doing that and getting a new tv for in here um the tv that i have out in the living room is a tv that's not exactly a smart tv it doesn't have like all apps that you can possibly get it just like has youtube and like prime video because i got this way before like smart tvs came out and it's surprisingly still working so today i'm just getting ready for work um work has been getting a little bit busier i'm noticing the packages are getting heavier already and it's not even thanksgiving so today is november 18th we're a week out from thanksgiving so i guess people have started a little bit but i'm just straightening my hair i think i'm gonna wash my hair probably today or tomorrow because it's starting to itch and whenever it starts to itch on my scalp i just can't so I've had it straight for 11 days now. So yeah, as far as the painting, it's a one man team. And I don't know where she found this man from or if she's used this man before or what the case is, but like <sighs> he's taking forever. He started last, he was supposed to start last Thursday and he didn't, he started Friday. And then Friday I came home, I was expecting it to be more than what it was and it was literally this wall one wall was done and I was just like okay his pace is pretty bad and this is gonna take longer than it has to so I want this done by my day off I just want to relax I have one day off a week I don't want to have to leave my apartment because you're still here like it's Thursday are you gonna be done by Monday I just don't think he's gonna be done like I've like unintentionally taken a couple weeks off from YouTube I haven't posted a video in a couple weeks 
and right before this like little break or whatever i was trying to get back more consistent with my youtube but i literally just have been at a loss for content i still want to put out vlogs and that's why i decided once a month but i wasn't meaning once a month i was going to do a video i meant once a month i want to do a monthly vlog i still wanted to do weekly videos but i'm just at a loss as to what to put out because i am not doing uber eats really like that anymore so it's like it's like what else do i film for you guys there's only so many like post office videos i can film without filming my day and whatnot you know what i mean i'm still gonna put out the vlog once a month and so there's a little behind the scenes stuff going on i'm not gonna speak on it because i just don't want people in my business <laughs> especially the people that i work with because for some reason there's a lot of people at work finding my channel yeah so when certain things are going on like before i would mention it because it's like i only knew like a few people that were watching my channel but now that people from work i'm literally watching my channel i'm just like thinking about stuff that i want to mention and i would normally mention it to you guys like i said but i just don't want things to get around before it needs to you feel me so we'll revisit that whatever that is uh, at a later date oh actually yeah i did get back on um a couple of apps because <laughs> i was just i just like i took a long break from dealing with men specifically and so i got off the apps a while ago because it was just so annoying and i've been off for months i don't even know how long i've been off for like a while and then i decided you know what let me see if anything has changed on here <laughs> and i would say that it hasn't i guess but you know i'll be patient i would honestly prefer to meet somebody in person but you know the apps are what they are so we'll see what happens but yeah for some reason a lot of men that hit me up they're really ugly and i don't know i've met not met but i've talked to one person who i found like was okay but the rest of them i just be looking at the profile and i just be like mm. <laughs> like mm. it's a no for me so somebody had messaged me last night and he was like I'm really interested please I'm really interested and I just laughed at it because I laughed at the message because I was just like who says that like it doesn't matter how interested you are in somebody that doesn't mean they're interested in you hun that's just the way shit works so just the fact that he said it like that I was just like hun don't ever say that to anybody else and like I just was like then he tried to ask me like how my day was going i was just like i'm not interested <laughs> i just wanted us to laugh at your message that you sent that's all oh my god why does time fly so bad so literally went to sleep at probably like nine and usually i'm up by like five something like an hour before my alarm today i did not wake up i woke up from my alarm and i was just like damn i must have been really tired <laughs> So I've been working like eight plus hours at work and usually on this route that I'm on, I get off by like two, three o'clock. So now that I'm like working the full time because it's like starting to get heavy and stuff, I'm just like, I'm getting tired. Hey you guys, the painting is finally, finally done after what seems like a couple of weeks that that guy was here. So he was painting, he was doing everything himself and it was taking forever. But it's finally done and I actually really like the color. The ceilings are white, the baseboards are white and I'm loving it. It looks so much better. I'm starting to get everything back in order. My room is done. I'm just trying to like get rid of things, clean out my closet and I am selling my couch. So I have it listed up on OfferUp. I've never used OfferUp before. Um, it's been on there for like two days. I've gotten people that been messaging me, seem like they're interested, but it seems like it was like scams or I don't know, but someone else offered 800 and i'm just like i think it's worth a thousand because i paid way more than that for this and it's recliner two of the seats recline so i'm just like i think a thousand is a reasonable price and i've already been kind of pricing out new couches stuff is expensive you guys like even just a regular couch is like a thousand dollars and like a good couch that's comfy and nice i'm wanting something like white or cream color and i found a cream colored one at regency furniture 
Should have got some footage that day, but I did not. I've been a bad vlogger this month, but yeah, I didn't get any any footage on Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to you guys. Um, anyways, I'm having a glass of wine. I had a rough day, guys. The day after a holiday at the post office is really bad. Um, and the route I'm on, it gets a good amount of packages normally, but now that it's getting close to holidays, it was pretty excessive today. I had 209 packages. I worked from 8 to like almost 7 o'clock p.m. That sucked. So I came home, poured me up a glass of wine. Yeah, so pretty much nothing has been going on. This month has been pretty dry. I'm just chilling, watching YouTube, drinking my wine, waiting for my wings to cook. About to eat dinner really late, later than I would like, but I got off late, so it is what it is. But I made a community tab post about like what type of videos you guys want. A lot of you guys said vlogs and stuff, which is cool, and Uber Eats videos, which I'm gonna try to start to make again, but don't quote me on that because I'm not like back into Uber Eats yet, so we'll see. But yeah, that's it for now. I'll see you guys in the next clip. It's Christmas. It's like, no. It's been a minute. It's been a couple days since I've talked to the camera, but guess what? The tree is out. Fine. So I have kind of, I don't even know. I just put this part of the couch here and then I've got the other side and then the other side over here. So I told you guys I'm trying to sell this couch. Still no offers, no serious offers at least. So I'm just gonna leave it like this until it gets sold. And then yeah, that's all I can do for right now. But I like this part being right here so I can just chill and relax. So. That's what I've been doing. I finally got YouTube TV, so I'm watching pretty much a lot of reality shows right now. I'm watching Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I haven't seen these shows in like years, so I'm excited to watch them. And I'm just trying to clean up from the painting. Like I'm just now getting around to dusting off everything and all that because I've been ripping and running for weeks and I haven't been home in the evening to like do anything. So now that was my day off today, I am able to get to some stuff. So it's looking halfway decent again. Yeah, I'm about to end this vlog. Next month will be better. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Come and take your place Cause the love you give You can't be replaced